Welcome to World Geography with Muhammad Adnan. Today tutorial is related to soil moisture index. As you can see, we already uh, estimated uh, the soil moisture index of the year 2010 of the area Haber Bukhanqa, the province of Pakistan. So in this uh, tutorial, as you can see, the high value represents the moisture area of soil. Uh, which is a very helpful in agriculture farming uh, for uh, planning uh, which area have more moisture and which area has less moisture so the with a light blue color have a um, uh, land area with a moisture soil and the, with a dark blue is a already water present area like uh, this uh, dam area and river so we now uh, share a formula which formula we use for it as you can see the soil moisture index the near infrared uh, band used with a short wave infrared uh, for different satellite it have a different bands for example for landsat 5 and 7 we use the band 4 and 5 and for uh, landsat 8 we use the band 5 and 6 so now I perform it we have a landsat 5 data so we use the band 4 and uh, 5 so first of all i open it from here uh, we have a data for year 2010 of kvk now i just add these two bands in front of you so here one more thing you need to notice uh, when we uh, apply this formula on the raster calculator the result which coming out uh, it will be in a percentage form and the result which I display behind this data it is in the standard deviation so the standard deviation will be classified where is the perfect uh, this value showing so you need to change it for a good result so now I will start so as you can see now we open the bracket and apply the formula band 4 minus band 5 can see from the word file band 4 minus because we have a line set 5 data line set 5 and let's 7 have same formula for it now next we close the bracket and with a divided then again start the bracket and band 4 plus band 5 now we again close the bracket and give it the output where we want to save it so here we select it uh, as you can see I already make so now I give it uh, uh, some changes in it because if the name are same so it will not perform so I make here keep one so ok it and check again the formula yes it's ok first subtract and add ok so it's little take time I skip the video so viewers as you can see it's well done and now we just uh, uncheck the other unnecessary bands and uh, here I give the same this color which we need uh, which we already have been given for our data I think this, this color we given yes this one okay so the high value of it will be in the dark blue and the lowest value will be in a, a light blue color so the below one I uncheck also when the upper one will be showing so I will be check it again to showing the difference between the percentage one and in the standard deviation one it will be little taking time because the area is very large it is a whole province of Pakistan so it's taking time uh, when it's uploaded uh, I will showing the difference between the standard and uh, the percentage one. as you can sh see it's a little uh, showing when it's complete showing I will go to its uh, properties yeah it's complete now uh, I open the properties and in the properties the most basic thing is this one and this is the percentage clip percent clip okay and this one will be in the standard deviation so will be you can use it in the standard deviation for the good uh, results and good results showing so 
the difference is that uh, in this area uh, the less soil moisture uh, showing but in the standard deviation one more uh, soil moisture area showing I can check it then the below one will be showing here so as you can see uh, it's loading and uh, the area will be showing with the moisture area perfectly so I hope this tutorial will help you so for more informative videos you need to subscribe our channel thank you so much